Next, let's talk about uh, sending and sharing content. Okay, we have a few different options for sending and sharing content. Let me just speak to those briefly. So the first is, of course, send a whole liquid text file. If you send this, it's an LT proj file, and that contains your documents, your notes, and everything in one big self-contained bundle. Uh, you can send those to your colleagues, and this is uh, the way we generally recommend collaboration right now. More modern invite-based collaboration is something we're working on and should be coming later this year. Uh, second, you can send things as PDFs or notes outlines. Uh, sending as PDF is great because you can basically send your entire workspace and all your documents for folks who don't actually have liquid text. So we'll just go through, select uh, that we wanna send all the workspaces and that we wanna send uh, all of the PDFs. We'll select our options and we'll say, we wanna have the pages match the workspace background. And then we'll export it. It generates the PDF. And we'll just send this right over to, say, Adobe Acrobat. And here we are. You see, it's combined all of the, your PDFs with all of your workspace pages together into one big uh, document. Now, one of the nice things that we have here is uh, if I've pulled out an excerpt from, uh, from a piece of text in, the, in one of the PDFs that's included in this, I can just click it. And it'll take me, see, right back to the page from the PDF that that excerpt was taken from. So it means a little bit of that liquid text linking magic is even preserved in the PDFs that we export. And the last one, of course, is notes outline. And I briefly mentioned that earlier. Here again, we take all of your highlights, all of your excerpts, uh, all of your comments, and combine them into a nice linear document that you can, that's really designed for being sent to Microsoft Word very easily. Uh, URLs that you put in here, are actually included, such as shaving the bone spur that we talked about, uh, and, uh, and images are included as well. We have a lot of options on the side for whether it should say, we have a lot of options for uh, how this is all formatted to kind of get it a little bit closer to what you need to make that subsequent stage that you're gonna do of fi uh, finishing it up in Word a little bit easier for you. Okay. Uh, and finally, we have auto send. So AutoSend is if you import a document from uh, a supported file sharing service, such as OneDrive, and then you maybe add some highlights to it or some other annotations, when you close the project in LiquidText, it would ask you if you'd like to take the annotations that you made and send them back to the original source document. So uh, this is great because it means that LiquidText doesn't do this automatically. Uh, it leaves it as an option for you. So if you wanna keep the original source document uh, untouched, you can do that, but if you want to keep your annotations sort of in sync with it, you can do that as well just by saying yes when it brings up the dialog box.